So I'm always being asked what's going on in the Naples real estate market. Well, in this quick video, I'm going to share with you what I see happening right now in the Naples real estate market. So if you haven't been to my channel before, welcome. My name is Lori Rose. I'm a local realtor here in Naples, Florida. And today I want to discuss what's happening here in Naples right now. So I work with a lot of buyers who are out of town. They're coming into town either to purchase a uh, primary residence or maybe a second home. And they see a little bit of slowdown in the real estate market in their area and they think that it's the same here. So if you have been watching my previous videos, you'll know that we've had a crazy busy year. Our strongest months for sales are typically January, February, March, and a little bit into April. Those are the months where our seasonal visitors are here. Our housing sales are not following the typical pattern. We have stayed strong throughout the year. We've had strong demand and our inventory month over month hasn't really changed. It stayed low and that has been pushing our prices higher um, as again, the demand stays strong and our inventory stays low. And if this past weekend is any indication of what's to come this season, we are in for a crazy busy season. Typically right now, houses are selling within the first three days of hitting the market. So if you're not here to purchase a home, it's hard to purchase a home. Unless you're gonna buy it sight unseen, you're not gonna be able to get into town if you're not here already to purchase a home. So a lot of people came down this weekend or this past weekend for the holidays and thought maybe they'll get a jump on the season. Maybe they'll be able to purchase a home before the rest of the buyers get into town. Well, that's a great strategy, but it seems like everybody had that same strategy in mind. And we had a crazy busy weekend. So unfortunately, if you're in the position of wanting to purchase a home here in Naples, Florida, you're still gonna find yourself in bidding wars. There's still low inventory, there's still high demand. So it's still gonna be difficult to purchase a home here in Naples, Florida. It's not impossible, but it's still really hard. There is still a lot of demand. And I don't see that demand changing anytime soon. We're definitely going into our strongest selling season. So um, anything were to happen as far as a slowdown happens, most likely it will happen after our season. So that's after April. Um, again, last year we didn't slow down. So who knows if we're gonna slow down this year or next year. And again, I wish I had a crystal ball to say what was gonna happen, but I'm, I don't, so I don't know what's gonna happen. But if you're looking at this year versus last year, um, and you're looking to forecast next year, I'm gonna go with the fact that we're getting stronger and stronger, prices are going higher, and I don't see any changes anytime soon. With that said, not every house sells within three days. There are homes that are overpriced here in the market and they are lingering on the market. Some sellers are being a little over ambitious with their pricing. Um, they want to get that top dollar the most they can get. They want to get the most anyone's gotten maybe in their neighborhood. And they really don't have to sell. They're just putting their house out in the market and they figure if the right buyer comes along, they'll sell it. It's a definite turn off to buyers to see an overpriced house like that, especially a way overpriced house. And that's why they linger on the market. But if you're looking to buy here in Naples, don't overlook a house that's been on the market longer than the rest. So after losing out on countless bidding wars, I've had several clients that have been successful in negotiating a lower price with an overpriced seller. They're finding it easier actually to negotiate with a seller uh, that has a high price than to win a bidding war. So if you can find a home that's been on the market a little while and negotiate with the seller, then you might find yourself in a better position than if you were to offer over asking price on a home that's going to be in a bidding war. So I hope that gives you a little bit of an insight into what's going on in the Naples real estate market right now. Um, if you have more specific questions on the uh, real estate here, just uh, reach out to me. You can leave a message here. You can um, find my contact information in the description box below. So you can text, call, or email me, whatever's convenient for you. 
So until next time, my name is Lori Rose. I am a realtor here in Naples, Florida, and I make videos like this one about the Naples real estate market, as well as what it's like to live here in Naples, Florida. So if these are subjects that are of interest to you, make sure that you hit that subscribe button so that you can see more of my videos as they come out. So again, I wanna thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Hit the like button if you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. Bye.